It's always a workout, getting all this stuff in the combine in the mornings. <sighs> well, yesterday we serviced, so uh, we don't have to do anything this morning other than check the oil. But I think the other combines are servicing, and uh, plus I don't think it'll go right now, so I don't know. I'll check back in when it's time to cut. Like I said yesterday, uh, we already serviced. And to get to the second part of the field, we have to go down the road here and uh, start in on the other side of Mom's Combine over there. Tessa's eating straight okra. I mean, it's pickled okra. That is disgusting. She's stinking up the whole cat. <laughs> well, we moved fields. Actually, we moved fields like three times. A while times. ago. Huh? We moved fields like three times. We finished the field that we ended on Friday, and then we moved to the one we just now finished, and then we moved to this one. The second field that we moved to, it was like a couple of little patches and little patches is like 100 acres here, so yeah. that's pretty bad. You want a bite? No, no, I didn't. Try it. No. Bad. But we kind of separated. The other combines are way over there. I don't know how many acres is in this field, but that's a lot. There is 978 acres remaining. We've done 30, so there's over a thousand acres in this field. Yeah, the iPad says there's a thousand and thirteen acres in this one field, so gives us more than enough room to spread out and everyone go do their own thing. So 4G's over here, and then the farmers combines are over there. Using a bathroom break. Well, I guess the block that we installed a couple of days ago is still dry, so uh, that's good. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, we were losing like anywhere from half a gallon to two and a half gallons a day in hydraulic oil. Turned out it was that block right there, and it was running down and running inside of the rock trap, so we couldn't see it. Are you ready? Get up there. Thank you. 
Tessa's running a combine. I'm down here watching YouTube videos, working hard. Gives you a pretty good view of the header though. Well, we're on our second stop for the day. And a couple of videos ago, I got a rock in my drum. And oh my gosh, the floor is bent. That's actually so sad because uh, we just put that floor in, in Kansas. But I'm getting Tesla to raise it up because I forgot to look at this cap, which it's still on there, so that's good. I think a couple of videos ago, um, that cap fell off and we put a cap that doesn't fit on there. And uh, we had to do some engineering, let's just say, to get that to work. Also, we keep on pushing dirt on this side and I uh, figured my skid plate was uh you know looking exactly like that so uh that doesn't really surprise me so we're probably gonna have to cut that off in the morning or something it's always something we're almost done we have until that right there and then we're gonna hop across the road and uh join the other combines anyways we're gonna continue on That is the most inconvenient <laughs> spot for a blinker and a horn. You know how many times I've accidentally hit that? Tessa, she got us all crooked here. <laughs> got us heading off in a wrong direction. finished up with the west half of the field. Now we're gonna hop over the road here and uh, go join that combine right there that's cutting out the turn road. Also with everyone's pickup in the bar ditch, it looks like we're selling cars out here. There's so many of them. There's also so many people out here that uh, makes this operation go round and round. So.
only five of us are lined up tonight. Dennis is still in the back of the field, um, broke down. He blew a hydraulic hose line and uh, he can't move his combine. So that combine's kind of stuck in the back of the field. But we did finish this field tonight and uh, today was the best day acreage wise for uh, North Dakota. Mom and I covered more than 400 acres, us combined. And uh, I don't know how many acres, you know, total with all of the combines, but uh, that was a pretty good chunk. So today was a pretty good day. But I am tired. It is almost midnight and uh, I'm ready for bed. So I think that is going to be it for today's video. Hope you all enjoyed it. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you on the next one.